Hello everybody, this is Mr. Funreel and I decided to create a tutorial about ripping models from almost every game. Now I use the program called Ninja Ripper which allows me to rip models from almost every game I own. In this tutorial I will rip models from Payday 2. What you have to do is open up the program and here in target the 8, 9 or 11 application search for the exe file which runs your game for payday 2 it's in program steam steam apps common payday 2 payday 2 underscore win 32 underscore release now I already ripped mods from this game and I know that intruder won't work I need to D3D9 wrapper. Some games need the D8 or even the D11 and some games don't even work at all. So yeah, I use the D3D9 D wrapper and if you want to rip models from Steam games you have to deactivate Steam, close Steam completely and then search your X file, your wrapper and then click on run. It will now turn on Steam and then also turn on the game. Now I am in PD2. The ripper is running and I could now already start ripping the models I want but I want specific models like this mask. When I now hit my ripping button the game will freeze for a short moment. Depending on how many mods the game has loaded it could take longer or not so long. The first model is ripped and then just for fun let's rip one more hit F1 and maybe even one more When you are done with ripping the models you want, you can just close the game again. Now you have to go to the folder where your exe file is, payday2, and then you'll have a new folder called underscore ripper. You click on it, and then the newest folder, which in this case is... Um, where is it? Over here, I think. Frame zero, 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 zero. Yeah, sounds about right. Now you need a program that can preview DDS pictures. In my case, it's DXD BMP. I can just open up the pictures. That's the muscle flash. The reason I do this is I could either open up every single model and check if it's what I want or the second method is you just search for the pictures or the textures you want to have. Now this here for example is a screenshot of my model without um, oh wait, this is just a screenshot without background this is a bump map screenshot this is the cube maps I think 
this is the face of my player then this should be the mask now this is the player suit this is the full body armor maybe I want the armor just search for the textures, this is the mask inside this is the cavity map, this is the inside texture map this is the mask diffuse the mask cavity and what this is, I don't know so anyways now you need to open up Autodesk 3ds Max install the Ninja Ripper plugin that comes with Ninja Ripper and when you are in 3ds Max go to Max Script Run Script Ninja Importer now I get this little window here and the texture I want is 0008 so I go here search for the ripping time and the frame I want mesh 0008 import and this is the outer hull of the mask and then I think 009 is the inner part of the mask yes and then 0010 I think yes now this is how the mask looked in game now I can export it you could create a folder on your desktop like payday to rippings and then I'll create a new folder for this tutorial and I think this mask is called Mrs. Mannequin Okay, save it again. Apparently, you're not allowed to use dots in it. And now it tells me the textures are 008 and 9. So I close it. And just for making it easier the textures 0, 0, 008 0, the 1 and the 2 and then the 3 what is number 3? yeah 3 is the texture that was on the mask and then I need the 9's too I just take all those textures and move them into this folder you could rename those to Mr. Mannequin um, base then Mr. Mannequin cavity Mrs. Mannequin uh, cube map I think it was then Mrs. Mannequin skin inner mask and inner mask cavity and now let's do it one more time in the second frame that's the skin of the player and if the second one, well in this case the second one is about the exact same ripping just a different mask so I guess 008 is the mask again. Yeah. And you can open up 3ds Max, delete all the models, and then redo the whole thing from the next folder. 008 import, 009 
in part and 0, 0, 10. And now in this case the outer hull is a little bit on a different spot so I just have to move it around yeah anyways this is the process of ripping models from games you can just rip the models like I showed then use the textures to find out which is the one you searched for and then open 3ds mask 3ds max sorry with the ninja importer import the stuff you want and then export it if you want to use 3ds max for modeling the model or doing something with it it's fine but I use a different program that's why I have to export it because my program I use doesn't have the ninja importer yeah that was the tutorial about ripping models from games I hope you can do something with it and yeah see you next time